The UEA Sports Park has been welcoming some quite extraordinary athletes this weekend. Tim Adamson from Cossies, 47, but had a kidney transplant in his 30s after being diagnosed with renal failure. He's since gone on to represent his country at the World Transplant Games. He used to play local football to a good standard, but since the transplants now moved on to badminton and volleyball. I was found to have sort of quite serious kidney deterioration and it was identified after a few years that I probably need to have a transplant. Um, and that's what happened to me in 2002. Without that transplant and without the generosity of my donor and the family that, uh, that consented to that donation, I wouldn't be here today probably, certainly not living the life I have. And uh, I've been really, really lucky. This weekend saw British teams taking each other on, representing the hospitals where they received their life-saving care. Tim's been able to travel all over the world, competing in both volleyball and in badminton in the World Transplant Games. All of it demonstrating just how organ donation can change someone's life. It gives you a focus and I, I suppose it would have been very easy for me to sink back into um, my original life but actually it opened a window for me um, to carry on not only playing sport and get healthy and fit and gave me a drive to sort of become active again but also just to sort of help promote the organ donor register and, and that is exactly the purpose of Transplant Sport UK. For Tim, he was one of the lucky ones quickly finding a match on the register. In the UK at the moment, there's 7,500 people who need new organ transplants, and more donors means more lives saved. For him, what's important is that people don't only just sign up to the organ donation register, but make sure their families know their wishes. I've got nothing but admiration for the individual that signed that uh, that sort of organ donor register card and, and actually their family that actually then, and they're given that very difficult situation, probably sort of like had to sort of make that decision and actually consent to it. But I've benefited hugely and I can only be eternally grateful. Back on the court, Tim knows someone's forethought and someone's generosity gave him a second chance, one he plans to live to the full. Neil Perry, Muster TV, Norwich.